think he's the best person to take this forward from here. Uh, thanks again. Uh, uh, regarding, uh, I think what we are planning is we'll have around 45 minutes of conversation where we start the discussion. And after that, we are going to sort of stream out of this room and go to the uh, Zotrope. Uh, you know why? Because we all, how many of you like to gossip? Nobody likes to gossip. Full lies. Full. Uh, how many of you like to gossip? Yeah. And when does best gossip happen? Sitting on a chair or sitting on the floor? Yeah. That is what we will do in the second part of the workshop. We will yeah. gossip. So you will sit on the floor. So thanks a lot. Uh, over to you. Vikram. So thanks Ravi and thanks to Alliance and thanks Abhishek and thanks to such a large institute. I passed out from the IIT and the Masters. After this I am coming to another institute like seeing so large is beautiful. Um, we have to 3 o'clock, no? Uh, like that we know, ending time we pakka, no? Eh? Yeah. But I am going to take some time and observing some people will come. But isn't this a better word? Yes. It will capture, I will use the mic. Oh, my hand I need it. Yeah. Super. All of you had lunch? Yes. Uh, get up. Because after lunch is the best time to listen to a story. Put your hands up. This is an exercise that I invented. I patented it without any copyright. Can you keep a serious face? As of your most favorite professors are standing in front of you. And put your hands slowly, rise up. Serious face, sir. Just because in front of nobody can see his face, no? That's what happens in a class. We can't see each other. Wait for the next round. We'll see. Don't turn around. Slowly up. Up, 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 up. <laughs> Don't finish. Uh, massage your back. Shoulder, ears, head, nose, mouth. And give yourself a nice massage. La 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 la. La 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 Now you still have option to go out. Nobody is questioning. And you have the break also to go. How many of you are okay with English? Kanda? Telugu? I can't speak. Tamil? Because Telugu, no? It's one language in which everything looks like foul language in English. Repu Randi. And that too doesn't not work. For everything they will end with saying, go to the loo, go to the loo, go to the loo. Yakka da loo, yeah, yeah. All loo on you, no? So like anybody, the Telugu is like one such sweet language. It's called Sundara Basha. So sweet that even all foul language will sound so sweet. Repu Randi. So that's where it is. Found his face. So why? The beauty of <coughs> storytelling is, I like to do face looking. Because when you see face looking, I know when you are going to sleep also. I have gone to four colleges in my life. I exactly know which bench will sleep at what time of the lecture also. And that is why this path for me to come up and down, up and down. Again you have choice. Sir, Namaskara. Namaskaram. Where are you? Sir, seriously is watching. Where are you? No, see, my word telling my husband's name is not even proud of you. Tell your name proudly, you know. Vijay sir is not your name. Full name, Vijay. They have a contact, yes. Loudly. Tell your name, huh? He's saying, keep quiet, sir. I enough, I told you my name, you know. Why are you asking me next question? So, where do we start with? This is how... All of you have this device called mobile phone. It's a very dangerous phone. Take, take your phone out. Please take. And now look at your neighbor's phone. And make sure your neighbor is putting in silent mode. Because we also will forget, but neighbor will remember it. Ah. So, what the stories in your mother tongue, father tongue? Because today, how many of, you have, how many of us have different mother and father tongue today? Because we move, we are moving slowly because the word mother tongue is obsolete. Somebody says, what is the mother tongue? Ask them. 
No, it's mother tongue, father tongue, grandmother tongue, grandfather tongue also. Because I have a friend whose mother is Tamil, father is Bangla, husband is Gujarati. Think of that child. His name is Kabir. Yeah, they talk like Kabir. Okay. So, when you are born, what language do you speak when you are born? Huh? Sign language. When baby is born, <laughs> Yeah. What language? Go on, go on, go on. There's nothing right or wrong. If you have a notebook, please close it. That's the worst device to take memory. You will not think. After going back home, you put it in the dustbin. All of us have gone to college, right? How many of you remember our notebooks? Even for exam, also don't open our notebook. We open a friend's notebook. Fast up. So when you're born, how many of you remember when you were, where you were born? Where you were born, not when you were born. Where, where, where? Hospital. hospital. What is uh, hospital name, name? Me. Huh? Tell. Hospital name is hospital. Eh? Huh? Okay, let me start with a story. Huh? Because I say storytelling, you know, sad, don't keep, I'm not a stand-up comedy, I'm a sit-down storyteller. That's why I'm sitting down. So, 1983, anybody was born? Raise your hand, sir. <laughs> Doesn't matter. So around that time, there was a mama, no, no, there was a lady and a man and they got married. After marriage, what happens? <laughs> what are you laughing? After marriage, what happens? Huh? What happens after two people get married? Family kidda. That's the swagrat will happen. <laughs> huh? But this, this daddy and this mother and father, whatever, husband and wife, after marriage, they decide they'll have two children. This is 80s. So, family planning was square family. One, they wanted to be a boy, other to be a... And, uh, like you said, fast forward, first baby came out in 1979. And the baby was a... Louder. Boy, like you said, boy only. Uh, and after time passed, 1983, the mama again becomes... And they, now they want a... Girl. And how many of you remember that your parents had ambitions even, even before you were born for your life? How many of you? Like before you were born already, they were written your LinkedIn profile. Facebook and all, no, nobody, Facebook is only for our, our old, older generation, no? For you and all, Facebook doesn't exist. And uh, this mama and papa said, if it's a girl child, the girl has to be a musical child or an artistic child. And they kept the name of the child. You know what the name of the child? Any musical name for girls in India? Huh? Sangeeta. Kimon. Geeta. Geeta Anjali. Full Geeta only. Geeta Anjali. Geeta, Sangeeta. Uh, or. Suruti. Uh. Pallavi. Anu Pallavi. You know who's, whose daughter is Pallavi? How many of you know the singer called S.P. Bala Subramanian? Telugu people. Tell S.P. Bala Subramanian. Tell us. 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 Tell and they after all googling all the names because those days no Google, no only neighbors are at Google. And googling they kept the longest name of all this called Sangi. 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 And Sangi the name of the baby. And Mama was only one month pregnant. After first month, what happens? After first month, what happens? Boy. Second month comes. How after first month, boy will come out? Very premature baby. <laughs> Not even quarter gram the baby will be. After first month, what happens? After second month? After third month? There are no photographers here. Eh? That is videography. Who will take pictures from a bat and smiling nicely? Videography can't capture their expression. That is what a storytelling. The difference between writing and storytelling is a telling is about the audience. <laughs> because if you don't respond, can I keep continuing the story? No. That's the difference. But by writing, you can go on because the reader is going to read it afterwards. Come back to the story. And uh, third month, fourth month, fifth month, after that? Six, after, seven, that? Seven, after that? Eight, after that? Eight, after that? Eight, after that? Eight, eight, eight. Ten will come. <laughs> after ten? La baby was four and a half kilos. Baby is still inside the tummy. 11th month also came. And it was November 1st. After 1st, what comes? Yeah. After that? 
after that morning came nothing happened after the noncha came nothing happened come madam come 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 fast you missed very crucial part of she said where do i go and after after the afternoon evening came correctly at 8 o'clock this mother gave a big sound can you replicate that sound anybody <laughs> coughing sound eh baby in the tub you will cough eh ha oh that is blasting sound <laughs> and the neighbors got to know this the camera can record because this can't come in the mic no you see a difference between the human voice and the mind this is called nada and this sound how many of you have gone to a church how many have gone to a mosque or a dargah gone to a temple do you like these places to be with a mic or a prayer without the mic yeah. can you feel what happens to a prayer with the mic and without the mic yes. that's the power of the voice a voice is therapeutic our voice is a prayer in whatever you been talking to a friend is therapeutic right yes or no then especially today's time somebody comes and tells you hi did you have lunch is that it's a it's a whatsapp which is better whatsapping or talking but then you said you like no why this fellow is coming telling me this whatsapp is okay come back to the story 8:30 this wailing sound comes and another sound comes what which vehicle comes what sort of ambulance makes I'm with this iron sound, dark with barking sound. What is that sound? <laughs> Trying, no? Anybody? <laughs> How many of you have remember a donkey sound? <laughs> Same sound. Ing ya, 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 ing ya. Ambulance girl, mother went into the ambulance. Ambulance went into the hospital. And in the hospital, she went into the labor. See what names you give, no? in a factory what do people do labor. and what do we name this word no labor word any english literature students here english is very funny interesting language a lot of time like kidnap no what, what is the meaning of kidnap updating a child no but what is the word mean kid is napping means you call kidnap <laughs> huh? and look at every word with a little more intense meaning you see how it is and chocolate late chocolate and late Ah, because late night you can eat it. No, that is why. And ah, uh, and mama gave a loud shrill. And in the labor, what is that labor and a factory labor same? But what, you give the same word for that also, right? And then out came the out. What happened? Out came the baby. baby. Uh, and the baby, what sound? Baby will give what sound? I'm not asking this. I'm not asking Wikipedia. I'm not asking Alexa. I'm asking human beings. What? Mia. <laughs> ah. ah. This is what happens when you watch Korean serials. Ah. What sound is the baby make? Take a deep breath. Take a deep breath. Take beautiful. Take a deep breath. Take a deep breath. <laughs> Now see the same sound in this mic. <laughs> I will go on with that. So. This baby came up because this voice has been trained for 25 years, and this mic can't do justice to a raw voice, right? And this baby came out. A mother saw the baby, and the baby was a. He's googling it. What baby sounds in India sounds like? And she started crying and put her head on the other side. But the baby will stop crying. Will start crying or continue making sound? And then came another character in the baby's life. Who is the other character in the baby's life? Father, Father came. And do fathers speak lots or in one word? One word. Not even O K Y Y O K. And he went away. He said, "What is the matter, boy or girl?" He went away. And then came the most notorious character in the baby's life. Who was the? Ah, uh, this brother. How many of you have such people in your life? Do you hate and love the same time? All siblings. It's a lifelong thing, and that's the longest relationship, even more than your cousins, because birth to death, this relationship has to come. You hate them or love them, the attachment can't be removed. And that fellow came and saw the baby and said, "You said sister, but something is dangling in the body. <laughs> return the baby." But this is not an Amazon delivery, you know? How can you return the baby? 
and mother didn't know what to do. She's like asking, what is Amazon delivery? <laughs> and he also went in. And then came the most important person in the hospital. Who is the? Doctor. Doctor. Imagine, yes. can, can a country work without chief minister and prime ministers? Law students. Yes. Same thing, a hospital can work without doctors, but can't work without? The nurse can pick up, pick up, pick up, pick up, pick up, pick up, and lifted that baby. Is that lifting a baby? Just five kilos baby lift. That's what happened. You sit down in a nice chair. I am standing. You are all sitting in the back watching. Take your hand. Lift the baby. Ah. Eat. Eat. Madam, lift the baby, madam. Ah. And she was lifting the baby. And because it was so heavy, she got hiccup. What is hiccup in your mother tongue or father tongue? Which key? Vikal. Tell me the Tiklu. Ekulu. So you learn new words, right? Any other language? Vikalige. Vikalige. Kannada. Vikalige. Because Tamil V becomes B, Venna becomes Venna, Vikal becomes Vikalige. And she started. And when somebody is hiccuping, what will you do? But that baby did. <laughs> Full on the face of the nurse. And so much the baby laughed, she stopped. Hiccup. She looked at the baby. Huh? And she asked her mother, Madam, what is the name for the baby? Mother said, Sangi. <laughs> madam, I have an idea for the name, Madam. You see, this city is called Madras. And Madras, what language Madras speaks? Tamil. And in Tamil, what is the word for hiccup? We can't call a baby Vikkal, no, Madam. We will take half the Vikkal and because it's 1983 and this Vikram Sarabhai adult is coming in newspaper, I think you should call this baby Vikram Madam. <laughs> Didn't understand. That's how I got my name. <laughs> Tube light effect this is called. <laughs> we all have your names. I'm shifting gears now. How many of you kept your names? How many of you kept your own names? But in a day, how many times do you use your name either visually in your ID card or your Zoom boxes or your asking somebody? How many times in a day? Seven, Seven eight. Huh? Yeah, I'm going to tell you. Sir, English, okay, no? So answer, how many times in a day do you use your name? He is thinking, I should have left the class. Huh? How many, just answer, how many times in a day you use your names? Many times. Is there anybody who uses zero times in a day? You know, the zero, your ID card has your name, that's all. Which means something that you didn't earn in your life, you carry throughout your life. The first type of story, I'm sure you know the works of Titan. Yes, sir. I'm having the first two words that you know. The first type of stories that you keep creating in your life is your own stories. Because if you don't create, nobody else will create your story. The way you create your stories is how the world is going to remember you. And one of the biggest persons who did that in the world is Mohandas Karamchand Gandhi. Every day he wrote thousand truths about himself. Right or wrong, I'm not getting into that. Just wrote. And if you have to, how many of you know Sharukha's wife's name? Very important for the world, no? <laughs> how many of you can talk about your own self for at least half an hour? Sharukha for half an hour? Just think, you get what I'm saying? You've lived with us for so many years, but to create a story bank about us is not easy. You can talk, can you talk without a breath reading with the audience? Talking is different to narrative to a story. A story is not a narrative, it's not a lecture. There's a difference between a story. I'm sure yesterday, I'm not getting to what story is because we don't have much time. So the first story that all of you are students or working people or mother, father, anybody is, Create stories about you in a story. Not like I went to college, I studied for 20 years, it's not a story. And if you can create that bank, you can, you can use it in your interview. How many of you will go to interviews in your life? See, the students don't answer that. You won't go to interviews, sir. Already sleeping, eh? Classroom, they're sleeping, in your sleeping. How many of you will go to interviews? Hands up. Uh, what is the first question in the interview they last? My name is Vikram Shridhar. I'm like the beta, I tell stories for a living. Can you forget my name for the rest of your life? 
you have a choice. It means the way you introduce yourself is the first impression you make for the interviewer. You don't talk about yourself, nobody else here. Resume is zero. Worthless. Today resumes are worthless. I'm sure you know that. What you talk is going to get your job. Yes, sir, no. Yes, sir. So first talk, be prepared to talk about yourself, not about your degree. Because degree, there will be 100 people with the same degree, useless. But can you talk about yourself for 2 minutes, 3 minutes, 5 minutes? And that's the first thing that you need to create. And not even that. Can you go back to your LKG time and create memories out of that? Try that. You will realize that that's very, when another, we, that's extremely therapeutic. When you start opening a memory and talking about a third standard, fourth standard, just try that. Let's write about, write an entry. How many of you like to write? How many of you, when you write a diary, feel relaxed? This is what I'm talking about. Because the moment you go flashback and rub your, we are all a hard disk, right? But unfortunately, this hard disk is so rutted because we don't, we don't bring back the memories into our life. How many of you know Jyoti Basu or Karnanadi or Vajpay or even Obama? Because you'll say those are not uncles and aunties of New York, my father's generation. Sir. Have you listened to their speeches? Yes or no? If not, so you can even talk, you can take even Shilakartikeyan if you want or Mahesh Baba also if you want. Do they use a paper or speak without a paper? Whom do you like? People who speak with a paper or without a paper? How do they speak without a paper? Because they do this backward wiring into their memory and bring it up. Of course, there will be masala. We thought all that they told is real. 25% eh? masala. There is no masala. Will you eat rice and dal for breakfast, for, uh, for food? How many of you can take raw rice and eat it for the entire day? You need a little bit of dal? Yes or no? How many of you like dal? How many of you like tomato? Onion? Chilli? Sleep will come after that if you lean like that. Ah, front, 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 shoulder. And madam, you, ah. You see, yesterday I spoke to some 500 toddlers, four years old. Therefore, yesterday I spoke to one college, about 700 girls college in Bellalar in Europe. Before that, in Bhopal, I spoke to some 1,500 students. Every time I speak, I want you to listen to me, no? No? If even one person doesn't listen, my heart will come out, no? Because I repeat. I didn't study to do this. I do this because I love it. So if you don't listen, it's not your loss, it's my loss. But not my loss, but it's your loss. Come back to the story. So which means that every day, um, quite a few. In the college, in the huh? Okay, I'll, I'll do a little bit, I'll move between Vayana. The only one I can do, I'll come to it. Yes? Oror, nalor, patta nimishan, 10 minutes, do for yourself, just write something about yourself, even if it is something that is like, I hate somebody, write it and tear it, not type, write, you know why, because which is the oldest form of communication in the world, writing is not, huh? Huh? before that, Let's do this story so quick. Sign language. What language is this? So sound is the first communication. Body is the communication. Writing is not the first communication. Your body and the sound that comes from it. Hey! Both the same spelling, right? Depends on who's on the other side. Amma or the emotion, lover and the bad emotion. I think when the mother is standing, it's one emotion of father. And lover is the that the hair will differ. Is there any language to that? Even today, I'm showing Manipur and certain parts, it's a whistling language. We are losing our sounds. And today, we don't even talk. 
talking is what I have chosen as a career because I realize that we stop, we stop communicating to our voices. After that, along with that came another thing which is we communicate with our five senses. Yes sir, Noah. What is the point that the baby is born? Have you seen an elephant or a dog? If you separate in a hospital, the baby is born. You keep the baby alone and the mother alone. Will the mother be able to find the child among 20 kids today? No. But a tiger has a litter of cubs and you take the tiger away and bring the tiger back. Can a tiger find? Yes. What is the difference? Humans are losing our senses. It was possible. Remember, go to a village, even now a mother will not talk to her. She will take the child and smell and say, this is what you ate for lunch, is it? Uh, we are losing our senses. Communication is always not about writing or talking, it is about using all our senses. How many of you are able to understand? How many of you smell your parents while talking? It is a very natural instinct, right? And that itself is a form of communication. We, our senses, we are losing our touch. How many of you, for example, in a church or a mosque or a temple, you see carvings on the stone? Isn't that the oldest braille in the world? Next is, we used to communicate using a body called sculpture or writing on a wall, which use finger or the body, somewhere in the body. After that, we started painting. We used the and then we started writing. When is writing? How many years old? Hardly 100 years old. Tata, but you didn't Did your grandparents write? Did your grandparents write? Or great grandparents? Go and ask them. You see the difference which means it is only a, but did they talk? Yeah. So which is longer, talking or writing? Talking. Don't lose that and that is what I am looking for. And writing is this and today do we write or type? And what do you tell? I wrote to you men, I wrote to you only to talk, 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 talk. So we are losing this to this. The first type of stories that we share, that we need to share with each other is our own stories. Because if we don't tell our stories, Wikipedia, Google will not know. I will keep talking, but if you sleep, I will come and bite your nose. <laughs> because I know this chair is like that. Hi, sir. Good morning. <laughs> so, so, once, try that for every day, five minutes, your college time, document it. Or if you didn't like the day, tear the paper. It's okay. Who cares? But write. You will see the difference between writing and typing. Typing is faster. Hey, what's up? Hi. Today I went to the college. Somebody wanted to write whatever language. The second type of stories are stories that are coming into our life through a medium, what we call the folklore. This is called Lokata, Nataparakada, which we, it says that, like Rajinikan says, if you understand, you understand. If you don't understand, you don't understand. For example, the thirsty crow. How many of you know the thirsty crow story? Who is the thirsty crow story for? Huh? Thirsty crow. Thirsty crow. Thirsty crow. Thirsty crow. But what is today who consumes the thirsty crow story? Children. Children. What color is the thirsty crow? Can you understand that from the black movement? Because the person who created the thirsty crow was a prisoner. Original, those who understand will understand. You don't understand, just a story, right? What are the crows searching for? Water. Resources, basic resources. I'll give you a story. Once upon a time, give me a favorite animal. Dog. Dog. Ma'am. Any animal you like? In Karnataka, right? Rajasa, nobody tells camel parvas. Out of box, out of alleys. Because it's a South Asian person, we can't tell you bring kangaroo from Australia. I think of you in top. Have you seen a giraffe? Have you touched the giraffe in the mouth? No. That's a different. Touch it, your hand will go along with it. Tiger. Tiger, tiger burning bright. Sir. Elephant. Elephant. Dog. 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 Why are you laughing for a cow? 
Hmm, discipline, decent, ma'am. Monkey. But there's one animal that is always there in India. We forget, we forget our next door neighbor. But somewhere else we bring panda, chimpanzee, and this was a porcupine. Mulla mandir. In Kerala, same word. Telugu, don't know, eh? Because it is our animal, ma'am. Mulla mandir. Because it's our animal, right? Yes, I know, ma'am. First thing, start loving our local. A little more than global. We have so India has 70 percent of the world's ecology, but even again we say favorite animal panda. <laughs> but there's a panda in India, but there's a red panda. That's different. And there's a porcupine. Ah, sir, you take from behind with all the fists and this porcupine. What does porcupine have that you and me don't have? Spine. Spine. And how many people have a porcupine? Go on. Go on. How many people have a giant panda? Really? Full look, full lies. It will come to you and see. And once this porcupine was this big, can you show how big is the porcupine? It's huge. We did. I saw in Ahmedabad Zoo, there are 50 of them. So this big porcupine was living in a place which is porcupine. Porcupine, you're asking spelling, eh? P-O-R-C-U-P-I-N-D. Tamil is called Porcupan. Like Samakachi, like that. And this porcupine was there. This porcupine was living in a very hot place of 40 degrees. And suddenly it became 30. 30 became? 20. Super, you all passed your max exam. 20 became? 10 became? 0. 0 became? Minus 10. Minus 10 became? Minus 20. Minus 20 became? Minus 30. Minus 30 became? Minus 40. And minus 40 is not like Shahrukh Khan movies. In Shahrukh Khan movies, he will be wearing dress, he will wear no dress. If you're dancing, you're not taking dress. But we are minus 40, it means you will, how many of you have at least been in some snowy area? You will realize even now, last week in Chennai, people were wearing mufflers and you guys have 25 degrees in Chennai. And so, and, uh, and when it's cold, how do you shiver? How many people can shiver? Like, uh, shiver? Acting, no? Uh, uh, shivering. And the porcupine was shivering, 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 and it minus 40. And that is the time we saw another porcupine there. When we are having problem, big problem, and others have the same problem, full happiness. <laughs> and it's all the other porcupine also there shivering, shivering, shivering. So this porcupine went running to the other porcupine and said, Ah, come, let's have eaten. <laughs> like you problem, my problem, you only go, well, let's go hugging, 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 hugging. And they hug each other, and the moment they hug each other, and it's what you think in 10 and 20 and little. So <laughs> the moment it became 10 and 20, then what do the spikes do? That's a good check, that's a good check. Correct. Reading. So you are the mood away. When the mood away, again cold and loneliness and dying, and it came together full bleeding but alive. What should they do? What, what do you think? Hands up and say, what do you think? Hugging and bleeding or alone and dying? Hugging and bleeding. Now I end the story here. You understood anything? And hence, after that they have each other and pray. I leave the story here. Has it touched your heart or your mind? And this is where a folk tale comes. So the first story I told about my name, can you tell it to somebody else? With the same effectiveness? But this part of story, can you tell me somebody else? Yes. I will tell you how. And that is how human beings are. When we are together, we will hug each other and our spikes will hurt the other person. The other person's spikes hurts us and we will bleed. Yes, I know that. The moment we are alone, loneliness is brilliant. But the aloneness kills us. We will come, we need human beings. So we come together, we are not the same, we are different to each person, right? Our spikes to our parents is different to our spikes to our mothers, to our fathers, to our teachers. We will hurt. Is there anybody in the world who doesn't hurt each other? Anybody? Can you think of only the most kindest person has become kind after hurting somebody, right? How many people you have your spikes? We all have our spikes, right? And we don't tell the outside, because we are all very gentle people. And when circumstance comes, our spikes comes. Everybody has its spikes. Like the porcupine, we will bleed. 
But if we don't be together as a society, our loneliness will kill us. Now tell me, has it touched your heart? Yes. And that's the power of a folk tale. Because a folk tale uses a metaphorical character to tell something of a human emotion. And this, of course, can be a writing, but this story can you tell to somebody else? And continue the process of continuing? And that is your second type of story. I know. Uh, that, that one is ready? Yeah. Because to the next half of the flow, he will already half asleep. Number one, sir. Bala ji, na kya sunna? Attendance is done. You can go. I'm not a teacher. I'm the last person who wants to teach in LA. Uh, I'm giving this. You get a five-minute break. Those who want to lead, lead. I repeat, I'm not here to take my attendance. You are. I've done all that and done. Like that, every story you tell children, thirsty crew, hand the daughters. Why is it travel the test of time? Because it has human emotion. But can you put another animal instead of porcupine in the story? Very difficult. Can you put another story? Bird instead of the crow in the thirsty crow? Very difficult. And that is the thought process that goes in understanding nature. You never understood nature the way we should, right? It's our ecosystem, right? Can an Andhra ecosystem be the same as a Karnataka ecosystem? Which means the stories in different landscape in India differs. Which means the camel will cover a Rajasthan folklore or an Assamese folklore. Louder. So think about it. And that's a second time. Which means using a butterfly or a man, you and that is how writers write, right? Is there any writer who doesn't who writes without their own emotions? And they use metaphors. And one of the highest Metaphors is used is nature. They can use human metaphors. You come to that. I'm not giving you a break. We will move to the other place. Those who want to leave, leave. Those who want to stay back, we'll talk with the three mother types of stories that we share with each other. Because in those days, our grandparents used to tell us these stories because they were the porcupines in their life. They were the crows in their life. They were the and when they told us, they felt better. As kids, we never understood stories, but as elders. It's therapeutic. It's therapy for the elder. But the moment you say occupy, you will feel and let out some sort of an anger out of you, right? That's all. Right. We move where he takes us. We move out or move it up. To you. Yes. 
Bu ne dakika? Kacamu tak, kacamu tak, kacamu tak. 
That's where I tell you tomorrow. <laughs> so, Ganda Benada is Bangalore story or Delhi story. Can I tell it in Delhi? Doesn't work as much. So, so that is your, give me other examples of heritage which is very specific to people and region. Huh? Sandalwood, for example, movies. Like once upon a time there was an actor and this actor when he was a little baby he used to like only biscuits. What biscuits do you like? Farlet. You? Good day. Huh? Imagine because we had Parleji, you are called Parleji. <laughs> He's thinking, I'll change my name to Good Day. <laughs> so he had like that Parleji, Good Day, but tried. One more biscuit, give him the names of biscuit. Fast! Five and six. With a four pound, milky cheese. And not this word, except one biscuit which was an animal's name. And that is why his name is Tiger? <laughs> Ayyova, real madam. <laughs> Ayyo, what is his name, you know? What is his birth name? Open your Google. What is his birth name? How many of you know? Shraf. Shraf. Shraf is part of poet as well. Hey, man, Shraf. See how important she knows it. So, but this is not touching her because he must be her, somewhere touching her collective memory, right? Same thing with Sandra, put like Purit Rajkumar story or a Rajkumar story. Anybody does. So cultural appropriation is what the heritage is. If I tell you Taj Mahal story, how much of a tell you won't stick to it? Unfortunately, we have grown up with Taj Mahal too much. But we don't know the Mysore Palace road. How many? Like, too much of data, I don't know. But look at everything you eat and you can story it. Like a chapati. Like a puri. Imagine a story out of it. I create a story. And you see how nicely you're able to write about it. How a puri, how many of you seen this, uh, I don't know, this ad when you are growing up, Sunfi's dad, huge puri used to roll down and down and down and down. <laughs> and it created a memory, right? That's what I'm talking about. So it can be things, it can be even a one paisa coin, for example. How many of you uh, remember ten paisa coin, one paisa coin? Or a grandma's watch, for example. Isn't that a memory for you? Can I write about it or you write about it? When, how many of you have read books where it talks about their particular heritage and that opens up slowly? Arkinana. So that's a third type of story we are talking about, which is extremely personal but heritage and cultural. It's a watch, but that watch that your grandmother gives you is very, very personal, right? So my grandmother gave me that watch, but my grandmother didn't know how to read the time in it because it was gifted by her first boyfriend and she kept it a secret till I was born. And the first person she asked to read it was me because I went to school. It's a great story out of it. And the watch will be real, right? And how many of you have such things in your house? It's very precious. Can you try storyfying it? I mean, storyfying, you tell it or write it, is that an emotion that's very special to you? Yes. That's what, that's the third thing. Personal is not this. Personal is what happens to you. This is why you bring another element which is specific to you in your cultural thing. Because this story I can tell somebody else, right? If you look, look at Sudhamurthy or look at any of the popular authors today, they'll get this in. AC on a half hour. Oh. Because breath is <laughs> ah, she's laughing, man. Yeah. What do you think? Will the fourth type of stories or that genre of stories that we consume today? Any idea random. You go to a bookstore, you'll find this is the highest selling books today. Fiction. fiction. What fiction? So fiction can also be fiction can also be the second and third story. Remember, folk tale and also can be fiction. Fiction is a general thing. Look at very specific consumption of fiction. No. No, go deeper. Romantic. can also be romantic. Romantic is genre. Go into type, type, go. Folk tale can also be romantic, remember. No. Dystopian. No. No. Okay. Type. Mythology. So Michael is very different to your personal, to folk tale, to heritage. Michael is very different. Common can be fiction, non-fiction. Even my personal story can be non-fiction and fiction. I can put masala in the first, in first uh, thing. So why is mythology very, very different to others? Because mythology is something that is being worshipped by a community. Once upon a time, there was, I'm not touching Islam, Christianity is I'm going a little outset. Okay, any of this is like me. But they are very strong story. I'm not I won't use the word Lord, I'm just using the word the person. There was 
somebody who loves to meditate. There's one person that is at everybody's house now in like t-shirt, sari, photo, go to Chitakala Parishad, everybody paints this person. Who's that? I'm not saying you're correct. <laughs> and this person loves to meditate one hour or throughout the day. Always we see what is he doing? Whenever you don't see also what is he doing? Whenever you wake up, what is he doing? Meditation. Whenever you sleep, what is he doing? Meditation. And is he opening or closing his eyes? Next time see the ah, see the statue. And where do you think he's meditating? In uh, Alliance uh, College, eh? Yeah. Under the Bali tree. Where is the Bali tree? Some parts of India. Sir, tu kamara, where na, where ami, where ami, where na, and turning behind you only sir. Oh, you ah. When a teacher says, let's say, Vikram, get up, you'll say, huh? That's what happened. What's your name, sir? Behind you, man. Adhukum behind you. What's your name? Krishna. Krishna. And you bring one Krishna story also. How are you, Krishna? How are you, Siddhi? How are you? Why not? Why not? This story is, you know, lawyers will have people's stories in the court also, right? Today, mythology plays a lot of verdicts on the court. A lot of cases have been fought on mythology. And what is Mahabharata and Ramayana today called mythology or? Ethics. 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 Does it happen? The word is changing. Come back. And this man is meditating. This is a large enough for tomorrow come. I will leave it. I will leave it. Because I realize that's what is happening. I have to sell my own show. And this man is always sitting and doing and one place in India which is tourist spot for Buddha, any any place? Both Gaya, anything else? Sanchi, somebody? Because I realize that's what is happening, I have to sell my own show. And this man is always sitting and doing And one place in India which is tourist spot for Buddha, any any place? Both Gaya, anything else? Sanchi, somebody in Allahabad place is there, no? Sanchi. In your display, he is sitting and these are all very cold place or very hot place? Cold, cold, cold. What cold, hot? Cold is hot, hot is cold. Like Valentur Lake. Where you frog also and then the full Kashmir. And camera person is on. But we need to do it, no? Probably. Hey, take them last week now. They don't even know that they'll call me next year. Okay, come back up. So Buddha is sitting and meditating in a very hot place like Sarna and temperature will be 20 degrees or 40 degrees? 40 or 50. And he has lots of hair like all of us? No. No, no. No hair. But in your photo, he has lots of hair. But that time he didn't have hair. He was good, bald, clean, shaved, fine. So that you might have to wear in the monasteries. All these moms and students will be wearing no hair. No, full fashion, full middle wear on the wall. So much you don't even know who is boy or girl. <laughs> Seriously, because hair differentiates our gender so much. Such a burden, right? When you go to the mirror, what do you do with this? What do you do with this? Full ahankara on this dead body. Because it's actually a dead body, you know? Why do you torture this? Why do you cut your finger? Because it has no life. And with this, how much of is happening in the world, you know? Covering it, not covering it, taking it out, putting it, little bit, lots, this much, half, quarter, full, only on this dead body. <laughs> Come back to our story. So this man was meditating, full, ba, 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 and became 55 degrees. 60 degrees. What happens with the head? Because the taba. You remember in Andhra recently people made omelette on the road, eh? <laughs> like that, head became taba. And a taba because what happened in the middle of the head? Crack. Sucks. You put a crack crack and a line appears on the head. And a line appears on the head. But this, a Buddha or a Christ or a Allah or a Krishna, only for humans or for everybody? Because that is what I am talking about. So everybody is sitting in front of Buddha and looking at him and seeing what is going to happen to the crack. But you wanted to crack or you want to see? But the problem is if you go and tell him, you're going to wake up in meditation. Do you really love somebody? Do you really want to do that? 
which you will be glad for are not very nice. You always want to be just for them. You need ambassador, you need a guy. After nobody is there. And so this human beings on this side. And then the animals that I describe, give me a favorite animal. Cat. The cats that you see, I have whiskers. Moment I do meow, he will hit him on the cheek. Tiger. <laughs> I'm too big for this tiger tiger burning today. Right? No. <laughs> oh, you're too funny, animal. Papa, when the cow says, why did I make get up only Buddha will be God? I am born. Gujarat, eh? We we live lion in Gujarat. Don't bring it in. But I will take red panda. But there is a panda in India called red panda. And as lawyers and anybody, please love, if you love ecology, India's ecology is after five animals, a school didn't go beyond it. They will say chief or giraffe, not in India. But they will they won't say chief or gibbon. Gibbon is in India. So come back. Huh? Huh? The red panda also said, by the time I jump, my tail is there. No. It will go into his nose. Very dangerous species like us. Huh? Which, which cat? Pussy cat? Pussy cat? Seven cat? Jandu cat? Cheetah? Cats in general. Cats in general. The cheetah is also a cat. There are two types of uh, cats. One is a roaring, one is a purring. Have you heard cheetah sound? Yeah. Say a number.
one hour. I know shows in which they they do this for one. It's called the Buto walk. It slows down our body. It's, great, it's another great exercise. You look at all traditional dancers because the body can't move slow anymore. They're used to this. They're not used to. And you won't even see the leg moving. One hour I can do this. Thank you. Clap for me. Anyway, what was the plan? Snail started its growth, but only what happened is because the snail goes, and whenever the snail goes, it will leave a track behind. Have you seen that? Yes. And it will be very chilly because it is liquid. <laughs> and unless you touch it, it's neither big nor small, just this small. And along the track of the track, the snail went at its own speed. And somebody makes you up like, <laughs> Or somebody does it, which is which will wake you up in your own peaceful state. We'll wake up. Maybe tomorrow also we'll wake up. We won't even wake up. But we'll have to wake up. So it was going in that speed. It went. It went. It went. It went. It went. And it went. And it went. Sat on top. And the moment it did that, we all love to follow others, no? Like that, others also follow. Not the other animals. They said, "Hey, hey, 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 hey." We don't have so much time. We go to our work, and one went, two went, two went, three went, four went, five went, six went. So totally, all nine of them went and sat at the top. And the Buddha said, "I will not write a story about you at all because you are my student." From that day onwards, snails are stuck on the head, and that is why in the entire Buddhism practice, only God and Buddha will have head. If you look closer, you will see all these are small snails. Out of context, so from a literary piece. What do you say? 
these four genres come with collective memory. The fifth is not completely from collective memory. The only thing with the fifth literary thing is no emotion. The emotion will flow only where it goes outside. But for example, how many of you have written content because of the create content? And that time we don't have an emotional connect, right? We just create and leave it out. But moment these four process, you have time and you will have an emotional connect. When you have to deliver under extreme pressure, is when the fifth comes. When you just create, you know that you know how the structure of a story is: beginning, middle, end. Cut, copy, paste. Cut, copy, paste. Cut, copy, paste. How many of you have seen the Tamil movie Raja Rani? Many of you have seen. Remember Mohan Raghav? Both same screenplay. That's all. So, what I'm saying is, the fifth is something you have to create. When this room will get little more, sometimes sleep will come. Hmm. Get up. So this is something I do as an exercise. This is the song I learned from my teacher. How many of you know this person called Shilpa Murubi? No. So this is a very, 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 very dirty song because it will rub your head off. Take your hand to your head. It's a massage song, and it goes like this. Deva, Deva, Egenni. Singer is always creating music as we walk. And 
if you're on the journey, you don't have to sit and think. You're always on that, on that journey. If you're only doing it one, two hours in a day, then it's your job. But a dance is always dancing, right? As a dancer has to have choreography time, but it's always creating work. Right? A musician doesn't have a... If it's not happening, which means still you're not connected to that team. Right? Let it come. Let it come. So be on the path. We're all on a path. You know, I'm not a storyteller. I'm on the path of storytelling. Tomorrow I'll be a storyteller. Don't let the don't let us tell the world. Let the world tell. You. And that is a journey. And when you're on that journey, there is no pressure to. When it's pressure, then. What about honesty? Honesty is just just that that's. Um, that it'll give you a headache to move. You'll, I mean. Look, any element that comes to you is because something has happened which is outside your natural You are under pressure. It's okay, let's say, say no to something. You don't have to say yes to it. And creativity, some people, each one is a process. My process, I keep traveling. Okay. This is a story, right? I came, sat here, Christian was putting his head down, sat down all the time. And I said hi to him, he said, but why is this? He said, how oh, words. And that's my story. You don't have to, so a creator doesn't have to wait for creating. It's happening all the time. And we're all creators. None of us, all of us in this world are creators. How many of you uh, used to draw when you were a child? How many of you used to dance when you were a child? How many of you sing when you were a child? Today, do we do any of those three? No. Why? Yes. Because you're still in college. All three of them? Ask yourself. Because as a child, we do all the three. But as we move, it goes up windows. Continue. I have continued to do that. And that's, that's where... Um, I'm using this loose word. It's like in Abdul Kalam, where you have a zen state, where you do everything together, or you have to do it. When you're in that state, you take time. Maybe you can stay at home. There's no pressure to do that. Life will give you. If not, work will give you. If not giving you, which means you're not working. And uh, Shabana once told me, to write one poem, I have to read a thousand poems. Her father told her. She said, I have not even read half a poem. Consume a lot of thought. So, uh, this is a question that I have been struggling with for some time because uh, I, 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 after publishing my first book, there, was a, there were many years where I couldn't write anything at all. In fact, I'm still in that writer's block kind of situation. And uh, the main issue that I'm having is conceptualization of uh, storylines. Is there, I get that yes, it's subjective for everybody, but is there a sort of formal like framework that is followed? Or in How many like movies is Satyajit Ray making us like? Any idea? Not many. Yeah, so which means you don't have to put pressure to me. Today's world is measuring by output. But please measure the process and journey. It took me, it took me 15, 25 years to even step out on the car and this what I mean. Putting a first book out, is it a self-published book or a publisher's book? Oh, I've got it through a lot. Is that a success or is it a process? It's a success. No. You'll we'll understand it later. Please be in the process. I hope you understand what I'm saying. I can. Success is tomorrow. The moment you attain it, push it to the next day. The moment you attain success, you are attaining it. So, be in the journey. What do you bring is the journey? Writer's block is not some big term. Under it. It's your journey. It's like a bad block. It's a journey. Please, enjoy it. And is it your, are you still starting or are you? Yeah, first. First year. Why pressure block under it? Go dance. Go, go, go to a dance bar. Don't even drink it. Just dance. You get your idea. Because human beings are pluralistic. So we need to dance. We need to sing. We need to. How do you say? Put that effect. What we do is we sit and think. It will not come. We have, we have to dance. We have to travel. So unfortunately, the Western world thinks sit, take a paper, and then think. Bloody stupid process. Travel. When is the last time you travelled without planning? Have you done hitchhiking? Like once. Hmm? Hitchhiking, 100 rupees you go from here to Delhi with hitchhiking. <laughs> yeah. you, know, you know what hitchhiking is? Yes, sir. And it takes a lick. Your gut out, even put your hand on and say, give me a lift. How many of you have travelled hitchhiking? Understand? Would that give you stories? Ask them. I have. 
Ah, that is where the writer's block is. It's all there. <laughs> so we put this and this separate. All is connected. How many of you travel without planning? And when you come back, how many stories do you have? Oh. That is all I'm talking about. Block under is only for taps and uh, ear cats, not for human beings. And why do you write? Not all experiences have to be written. Keep it to yourself. It's a medium. And enjoy the process. Next time, no. Next time, don't say I've succeeded by publishing a book. It's a, it's a failure. There are people in the world who have not even written. Don't do it. Success is not a measurement. There are so many people who have succeeded and have all ailments in their life. Be in the process. Here, Aman will never say he succeeded. Hello, Bogoro. So one is always saying that why uh, we are all in the process. Uh, for example, I uh, how many of your parents have gone to school? My parents didn't go to school. Six and a Tamil medium for you. I used to stand until seven stand. So my manager once said, go to Toastmasters. I said, why? You have to improve your communication. Then he understood I'm communicating in the wrong space. <laughs> you have to criticize yourself. <laughs> One thing you shouldn't do criticism is hurt your body and your soul. Because these two are the fulcrums for it. Never hurt your body. So whenever you feel like you're criticizing yourself to an extent is hurting your body, go to your friends or go somewhere out. Just go to the Go to the forest. So whenever that something has happened, I've always taken that from nature. Nature is a great place. Like dogs, I, mean, I used to volunteer with uh, Blue Cross in my, my child. Because I've had issues in my childhood. Blue Cross, you know, I would have let you. I'm as suicidal as somebody else. But be with animals. Animals are a great place. Not the wild animals. Let them be in the wild. <laughs> and also dogs don't go hunt the So many things. Just be with nature. And Bangalore has covered by most of it under the tree. So we won't even have them. So we say criticism that is hurting you, don't be alone. And take a mentor, find a mentor. It can be a friend, it can be a teacher, it can be somebody in the community. Today we have festivals, right? In whatever. And writing again is not an upper hand. Today this thing of, oh, I'm a writer. Be a human being. It's better to be a human being than be a good writer. I I read human beings.
using that because I know laptop also has uh, documents, but I want I don't want to lose the habit of writing. Um, so I mean, it's there in my room I can show. So I write down whatever stories I consume. These are oral lows in different languages because unfortunately books have copyright issues. So, uh, but the Indian stories that many that do. So that's cheetahs, you know, when you took that example, whether it's pouring or whether it's roaring. So, you know, that instant, that to create that, you know, effect on your audience. I mean, that's, that, that's exciting. So that's an improv element to it. And uh, one of the biggest things I can tell you with storytelling is know when to end. Ending of a story doesn't mean ending of your conversation. You need to end. That's why I finished the workshop at 3. Because today, we don't value time. So ending is as important as starting. So that's something. So ending a story is as important as even saying one word. Ending a lecture is important. Ending a conversation is important. Silence is a bigger, better conversation element than keep talking about it. Conserve your energy. So this Naga is um, prayer. If you understand, you'll understand when I'm okay. But this is a prayer that today we're losing. So the moment you listen to somebody's voice. In Japan, apparently, we have people hired to talk to. Already started, I don't know. There are dummy people who just come and sit along with them. Walk. I'm, I'm afraid to come to India soon. We didn't have India. In India, dance, music, arts is already a therapy. We are bringing them into therapy. But India, arts is therapy. Please have arts or sports in your life. Sports for the physical body, art for your body. Studies are important, definitely important. But don't lose the arts and sports in your life. And that, if you follow arts, will keep, and I continue it. I mean, don't, you, you can do three things in life. Right? That is liberal arts, right? Yes. It's not about being only one thing. And like, just because I'm liberal arts, so I won't touch this. No, do not take in. Go beyond. And today, I spend with gender, do a thousand things that you can. Like the way I sit. When I, when I the last time a professor sat like this in my class? There's no pressure, right? I'm a human being. But trust me, what you take back is much more than what you take in your class. It's not about the way you communicate. It's about what you and that itself is, that's the community of talking. So, that's what it is. Thank you. Any other questions?
Rendu peru itu jatuh lihat Sharaba and Narasimha. World can never be unique. Unicorn. They are all two sides. What it shows this, what it don't show us this.